Hey everyone, today we're going to go over that old gospel classic, The Last Mile. This is on page 33 of gospel book number 3, and this is an old traditional gospel folk song. Uh, it's dating back to its first known recording in 1926, and the uh, music was written by William E. Marks, and the lyrics were written by Johnson Oatman Jr. Now through the years, this famous song was sung by uh, many artists such as Mahalia Jackson, Sam Cooke, uh, Red Foley uh, and the Hee Haw Gospel Quartet and many others. So let's get started. If I walk in the pathway of duty, if I I play this song in the key of G. However, if G is not your singing key, then slide that capo around to find a key that fits your voice. The time signature is 6-8 time, kind of like a 3-4 waltz, but it's 6-8 time. And the tempo is usually a slow to medium, around 100 and 125 beats per minute. The tempo has been varied throughout the years, so feel free to find a tempo that feels right to you. The strum pattern for this song is a simple down, 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 up, down, 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 up, so... Now let's talk about the intro and the breaks and the ending. For the intro, they're basically doing the last line of the chorus, and it's just a G, D to the G. And you can go... So... Now you can put that in between each verse or after each chorus to put a little space in between the verses and it also works at the very end. Okay? 
you want to put that C uh, with the G in the bass, that'll work as a um, the gospel ending, as we call it. Now, if you want to put an instrumental section in there where you're playing a solo, just play it over the verse part, and that'll work just fine. This is basically just a cowboy strum, you know, like a one, two, three waltz type thing. you go. Hey, thank you for watching and hopefully subscribing if this was helpful to you. And I hope you've enjoyed the last mile. And don't forget to get book number three with the chords and the lyrics for your iPad or your phone. And we'll see you next Sunday.